I just bought a larger ice tent, so I need a larger heater. And of course I'm going to go with Mr. Heater, and I'm going to go with a big buddy. Now this holds two of these one pound propane tanks, and that's going to give you about 11 to 12 hours of runtime on low. Now there's a couple things that uh, people don't know about these. They are rated for indoor use as well. That means you can use them in your house, let's say your bedroom, a bathroom, or a porch. They're rated to be ran on low and medium. Uh, it does say in the instruction manual not to run it on high if you're running in, indoors in your home. I'm going to get it unboxed, show you that there's really no assembly at all. We're going to put on the propane tanks, and I'm going to show you how to start it up for the first time. Just keep watching, we'll get started. I think the only thing you need to do with these heaters is just completely take the plastic off. And there's no assembly required. Now another feature with the Big Buddy that the other ones don't have is there's actually mounting holes on the back of this. So you can hang this on your garage wall and use it in your garage. Or if you have maybe a shed out in your backyard uh, that you're going to do uh, some woodworking in or a little wood shop, you can actually use this to heat um, a small one car garage or a small shed. You can use it in your ice fishing tent. Or like I said, if you uh, maybe have a porch on your house and you sit out there to smoke or something, you can use this to keep that warm. Now the Big Buddy has two propane cylinders. You just open up one of these doors. I've already got this one installed. And these unscrew Put a new one in, screw it in, rotate it back in like that, close this up, and you're ready to go. Do the same thing on the other side. Now a lot of people return these to the store and say they don't work because they've never used them before. And when these are brand new, they have air in the lines, and you need to turn on your pilot light about 7 to 10 times when these are brand new. So in order to light the pilot light, Especially when these are new, you're going to have to do this several times. You're going to push down, bring it over to pilot. You're going to have to do that several times when this is new. Once you get the gas fed through and you've used it a couple times, it should ignite on the first or second time. As you can see there, the pilot light just lit. I'm going to hold this down for about 7 to 10 seconds just to make sure the pilot light stays lit. Now the pilot light stays lit. I can go ahead and push down just a little bit. Bring it over to low. You don't ever want to go from uh, pilot to high. Uh, you have to go from pilot to low and then you're going to see this left side uh, start to glow. And then once you heat up this left side, go ahead and then turn it to high. After about one minute, you'll see that this left side is glowing nice and hot. Now we can go ahead and move it up to high. You're just going to push down about an eighth inch, rotate all the way up to high, and now you just saw that the right side lit up. And after about one minute, you'll see that the right side is catching up with the left. It's glowing nice and hot. So total runtime on the Big Buddy is going to be about 11 hours on low. You have to use both tanks. Now if you're going to put it on medium, you're looking at about 5 hours. If you're going to keep it on high like it is right now, it's only going to run about 3 hours on two tanks. Now if you are going to hang this on your garage wall, this will easily heat a single car garage. They make an adapter kit so you can hook up your barbecue grill propane tank. That's going to give you a lot more runtime. otherwise you're going to be going through these little one pound cylinders. You can order that separately, it does not come with this. And then you can easily heat your garage uh, whenever you're out there working on stuff. I've used the smaller versions of these 25 years ago and they actually still work. Now one tip I can give you, when these are brand new, I suggest you put them on high, let them sit outside and burn for about 15 minutes. They will give off a little bit of a chemical smell, and you don't want to do that uh, when they're brand new, bring it into your home or bring it into your ice shack. Now it's December of 2022, 
and inflation is in full effect and these things are running about 160 to 170 dollars you know two three years ago they were like 129 they're still worth every penny they're going to keep whatever you have them in nice and warm i'll put a link in the description below on how to buy these off amazon they'll show right up at your doorstep within a few days hope you guys found this video helpful and informational and thanks for watching